Hello everybody, welcome to Digital Painting and Photography channel. This is Toshiyagi from beautiful little island Okinawa, Japan. I'm a photographer and shot this image long time ago. 35mm black and white headshot. And uh, I got this AI colored image. Pretty nice. Look at this skin tone. Pretty really nice, huh? And uh, interesting colors. Well, overall, interesting image. But nice skin tone hair. That's, I think, very good at this headshot kind of image, I think, to colorize. Because, you know, look at around the eyes and stuff. A little saddle pink. That's nice. How they gonna make it? I don't know. Well, that's interesting and uh, I got this image mm -hmm. now so I made this pencil drawing type of image using filter well this is fine edges and the color is neural filter this is my subject and uh, let's make something interesting image all right let's get started okay now we gonna have let me see, change blend mode of pencil drawing type image to find out something interesting image. Overlay, soft light, half tone, hot light. This is nice too. Mm -hmm. Pin light, that's cool. Usually compared to luminosity, luminosity or pin light. I think pin light this time is more nice pencil drawing type of image and uh, color wise. This I think that I like this balance. I think yeah about this. Okay, then uh, dark on this colors. I'm gonna duplicate this AI color. I don't. I'm not using original black and white image, so just turn it off and uh, duplicate this AI color. Then move this one over this pencil drawing type image. Then change blend mode to color. Only for color from this AI colored image. So we're gonna get nice darkened colors some. Yeah, this is nice. This is as a base image. All right. And uh, pretty interesting. Nice color balance though. Blue color to my general wish. I like this combination of the colors. Okay, now add white layer over this and Fill this layer with white. Now, okay, make mask. Reveal this white layer with drawing to evolve. And brush size is pretty big. Well, then real thin first. Let's see how it's gonna go. Less expression of the models. Okay. Now I like the real shadow makeup too. Let's see. Give it some contrast from the combination of this pencil drawing type image and the AI colored. I'm gonna duplicate these two layers. Make group. And then duplicate this group. Now move this one up. Then let me see this combination. Change blend mode of this pencil drawing type image. Max opacity and uh, well overlay. This has more contrast. Maybe overlay pencil drawing type image opacity down to about I think half, 50% is alright. 
pretty contrast image, right? Now flatten this pencil drawing type image, overlay effect. Flatten this image. All right. Now we can pick up, uh, pick some shadow area to bring up contrast of this real shadow illustration type image. Let me see. Make mask. Then invert this mask to hide this overlay effect image, right? Okay. Then show some contrast over this image. Now reveal this to show this image, right? Shadow area. Okay. With the same brush, evolve, but real thin and go from about this. Let's see. Okay, now let me see. Change brush. Drawing group to gloaming. A little bit small size. Okay. Now, I want to add some gradation color layer. Give it some texture of the brush and gradation color over this. Okay, okay, with mask, invert this mask. Now we use the brush, evolve, to give it some texture of the shape of the brush to make a little window. Okay, now we add color with the soft brush. Air brushing to soft brush. Bluer, bluer color over this image. This gradation image is going to give you some first feeling, nice feeling. Alright, pretty nice. Now I'm going to fix the overall image. I'm going to hide this 35mm frame, which is come from here. Uh, no, oh, let's come from here, white layer, right. Okay, that's about this. Now, color-wise, pretty nice, it's simple, only the four colors. Now I'm going to finish up her face to show up. Maybe add some colors on lips, a little more darker, and eyes, eye shadows. Okay, just add some colors over this overlay effect image. Yeah, okay, just add color. Add layer for makeup. Maybe brushes, just soft, soft brush. And the, the eyeshadows to touch pinkish. Yeah, pretty clear type look. All right. Now I want to add some texture over this. Okay, change brush to evolve. some part of dark area. Yeah, good idea to use texture of the brush. So I think it goes blend in to other colors and stuff. Yeah, okay. Let me fix this color gradation window. 
just here. Alright. Maybe a little bit too light. So maybe touch darken. No, this color is alright. Okay, touch. Okay, let me see. From overall image. But let's see. Maybe eyes darken some. Let me try. Review this with soft brush. Clear eyes. Let me see. Fix some. Just a touch more with texture evolve. I think skin tones pretty light, too light. I think so. To darken the skin tones, though, there is. I think there is many ways, but I think easy way is find darker skin tone, then make one layer, then use mask to blend in. So find some dark skin tones first. Let's see, turn the other layers off. I guess we're gonna see this group image. Alright, now AI color is this, right? This is, yeah, she's a light skin tone. So let's see, if I duplicate this image, AI color image, then move this one up just very top now then once again make duplicate AI color now double this AI color base image one of the top change to color burn maybe a linear burn is much more darker skin tone isn't it color burn max is just contrast is up so maybe uh, linear burn and tone about 50 or so or let me see multiply maybe it looks more natural dark yeah i think multiply is double the highlight area as well so okay let me see let me try on this multiply image double this AI colored image march down to make one layer first okay march down now this is double AI color base image so darken colors but I'm gonna use skin tone though okay face area now make mask invert this mask okay then other layers turn on all the layers now to darken this image i mean the skin tones okay i don't know what's gonna happen it's this dark skin tone layer is very top okay now i'm gonna reveal this mask let me see just curious use evolve need texture not just soft blend in i'm gonna use mask to blend some okay use this texture with the brush let's see i'm gonna find out some interesting texture because it's gonna show up this way okay i have another idea make whole cover her face then make gradation opacity or some let me see just make hole first right max density okay we got the hole pretty sharp edge then i'm gonna tone down with the soft brush leave this shape of the brush okay in this case I can select how much we're gonna darken her skin tone okay now I got an idea now we got the dark skins right here so move this layer 
maybe under this white layer. Let me see, before I move this, oh, okay, move this under white layer. Let me see, it's gonna happen this way. Okay, how about, but it's dark on her skin tone though, this much. So in this case, let me see, let me see, move this one up over this overlay effect image. Right, it's take out some. Now about this, maybe tone down this. All right, now it's, I just don't like this shape of the brush here. So I'm gonna make mask again. So fill this layer with black, just clear that. Okay, once again, make a little window, hot shape, it would evolve. About this much. Then uh, again, mask this with soft brush. Just dip the shape of the brush, some subtle shape, but you still see the darkened skins. Well, this is digital painting, right? Only you're gonna use the part of the image. Maybe leave the uh, light skin tone on her cheek or just a touch bottom of her eyes. Well, I guess nice control with like this shape of the brush. It's darkened skin though. Maybe, yeah, how's this? It's all right now, I think. Well, that's it. This is darkened skins. Right on. Well, that's it. That's the way to darkened skins. Not that difficult. Okay, all right. From here, okay, I got the original image, black and white image. Then I made AI colored image. Then I add pencil drawing type image, add on this AI base color image, change blend mode to pin light to get this real saddle pin light effect image. Then to darken colors, I just double the AI color base image, change blend mode to color to add on over this image to get so much dark colors, pretty nice color image. Then I add white layer with mask. Then to get more contrast image, change overlay effect image over this with mask to get so much. Then add color around surrounding this image is gradation colors, like so. And color over her face, like lips, and some eyeshadows and stuff, like so. Now I got so much light skin tone, so back on this her skin tone, just add to AI color base image, one of the AI color image change to multiply to get dark image of skin tone with mask, like so. Only for this, this much window. Well, that's it for today and uh, is that it? Yes, all the layers on except this original image. Okay, that's it for today and uh, thank you for watching my video. I really appreciate for you guys support and um, you guys have a nice day and see you next time. Bye now. Ciao. Good day.